Ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to take a few seconds and talk about something I feel very passionate about, and that is Brian Ferguson's Bumps and Thumps podcast. You're available on YouTube and any other outlet where you can get your podcasts from. Brian Ferguson interviews several former AWA stars, Greg Gagne, Derek Dukes, and many, many others. Take a trip back in time to the AWA's glory days with Brian Ferguson on Bumps and Thumps. Here we are again, ladies and gentlemen, back in action with the 1987 Supermod. I'm your host, Brad Drake, and this is my AWA save. Tonight, we have traveled over to McHenry County, Illinois, where we will be running a spot show. This show is going to be a fundraiser for the McHenry County College, uh, let's say, Booster Club. That's right. We're going to raise money for, no, better yet, for the Alumni Association. We're going to do this, yeah, definitely, that's exactly what it is. We are, this is a fundraiser that we're running for the McHenry County Alumni Association. And, of course, I just clicked off of the McHenry County College. Okay, there, there we go. I clicked back on it. We're good to go. I'm all over the place here, everybody. All right, backstage incidents. We have none. Uh, absent workers, nothing but the severely injured Jerry Blackwell. So, let's take a look at our card for this evening for this spot show. And in our opener, we're going to have Penny Mitchell face Wendy Richter. The Nasty Boys are going to battle DJ Peterson and the Trooper. Steve Olsonowski will face Cactus Jack. Kevin Kelly is going to wrestle Ray Stevens. The Semi-Main is going to see the Texas Hangman versus the Guerrero Brothers. And in our main event this evening... Doug Summers is going to face Scott Hall. With all that said, with all that said, let's get to booking. All right, Mitchell versus Richter in the opener here. Here we go. Here is Penny Mitchell. And there is Wendy Richter. We'll leave this one open-ended, but I have a feeling we're going to see Wendy Richter on top here. Next, we have, going 14 minutes, we have the Nasty Boys. And they are going to battle Peterson and the Trooper. That's right. And the Trooper, of course, Del Wilkes, is all healed up and ready to go. We're also going to leave this one open-ended. Next, we have Steve Olsonowski against Cactus Jack. That one's going to go 14 minutes also. And everybody, in case you didn't know, we are bearing down closely, very closely here to Wrestle Rock 88, which is going to be held at Comiskey Park in Chicago. Outdoor show, third week of May. The weather should be beautiful. We're going to leave this one open-ended also for a spot show. Next, Kevin Kelly against Ray Stevens. They're going to go 16. And we're going to leave this one open-ended also. In fact, we've had every single match on this card so far go open-ended. And why not? It's fun sometimes to let the AI decide who's going to win the bouts. All right, here's our semi-main. And we have the Texas Hangman, managed, of course, by dastardly Don Carson. And there they are. There's the Texas Hangman. And they are going to face none other than the Guerrero Brothers. And just for the heck of it, we're going to leave this one open-ended also. Of course, our main event here, it's going to go 25 minutes. And we're going to see Summers versus Hall. 
Okay, big main event here. Doug Summers has been rock solid. I was concerned when his tag team partner, Buddy Rose, left that he would struggle on his own, but he has not in the least. He's got a new manager, too, in Baby Doll. We've got things rectified with their problems. And we are going to have this one go to a draw, everybody, because that's what you do with these spot shows. And we are going to have a double DQ finish. It's going to be an epic. And with that, we are ready to roll here. We're at our usual 111 minutes, so just shy of two hours. We're ready to rock. All right, there it is. Just as predicted, Wendy Richter gets the win over Penny Mitchell. And no red text the dooms. That's always a good sign. And here we go. Whoa! And a shocker here. The Nasty Boys have beat DJ Peterson and the Trooper with that double DDT. And 61 overall. Good score for these two teams, no doubt about it. And Steve Olsonowski, another shocker here, beats Cactus Jack. So we have gone face, heel, face. See if there's any takeaways, just the holding back business. And next, we have Kevin Kelly and Ray Stevens. And Ray Stevens has defeated Kevin Kelly. So we have stayed in order here of face, heel. Well, you get the point. <laughs> We're exchanging wins here across the board. So, of course, we have a, some holding back penalties here. Ray Stevens is punished for declining physical ability. And we're moving right along here to our semi-main. And the Guerrero brothers have defeated the Texas Hangman. Hector gets the win over Killer with the Butterfly Suplex. I like it. 79 is the score on that one. Not bad at all. Not bad at all for a spot show. So look at those numbers from the Guerrero brothers, 88 and 90. What a team. All right, let's see how this main event goes. 83 overall for the main event. I like it. And, of course, they go to a double disqualification, just as we predicted. And we drew 4,400 people for this match. The AWA did run McHenry County College. This is a uh, spot where they would do shows at. And also, Windy City Wrestling would run McHenry County College also. So this one's wrapped up. It's in the books, everybody. We get an 80 overall for a spot show. That's a terrific score. And this has taken us right back onto the tour where we should be in Milwaukee here. Of course, McHenry to Milwaukee is probably about 130 miles. And that's just it. We are going to start off in Milwaukee here. There it is. Crockett has hired Paul Orndorff. They wanted nothing to do with him until we went to go sign him. And that's what happened. The WWF is breaking up the Heenan family. you got to be kidding me. And now Crockett is also interested in King Kong Bundy. Fair enough. All right. <laughs> Scott Hall doesn't like Wendy Richter. <laughs> All right, we're going to make a change here, everybody. Uh, we are going to change the name of Psycho and Killer. So Killer, which is Mike Moran, he is going to be renamed Hangman Number 1. And uh, Psycho is going to be renamed Hangman number two. I noticed that in some promotions they were known as that. So that's what I would like to have them as. All right, let's look around and see if there's anything else that catches our eye here. And do we dare even look at this live event? Buddy Rose over Jimmy Snuka in the main event. And nothing else. 
89 overall for the show. And Crockett ran. Let's see if it's Mike Graham on top. And it is. <laughs> Just as I predicted, it is. Oh, man. CWA's running. Rich over Lawler. Whopping 158 people. Let's take a look at these other companies. There's no way that Wild West, they're 1.2 million. And they do not want to sell. How are they still operating? How is this even possible? I have no idea, everybody. No idea at all. So, all right, that's going to do it for us here, everybody. We'll be back in action tomorrow, kicking off the next tour date. If you haven't done so already, make sure you hit that subscribe button and leave a comment below. Let us know how you found the channel. Let us know if you like it, if you dislike it. Talk to us. We'll be more than happy to talk to you back. Also, hit that like and make sure you share this video with your friends. Sharing is caring and caring is growing on YouTube. Version 9 is available of the Supermod. Go to braddrake.net, drop me a line. I'll be more than happy to send you over a link to the database and also to the picture pack. Don't forget, you can always make a donation to the Cauliflower Alley Club through my site. That's braddrake.net slash supermod. Also, join us on social media, facebook.com slash groups slash 1987 supermod. You can also find us on the subreddit. TEW 2020 Friends. Thanks, everybody. We'll see you tomorrow. Do you enjoy our YouTube content? Do you wish there was more? Well, now there is. Patreon.com slash Powercast Network. There you will find, just starting at $5 a month, more access to podcasts, to shows, to other saves. Check it out today, everybody. That's patreon.com slash powercast network. <laughs>